Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Nag missile also known as Prospina is a third generation all weather fire and forget lock on after launch anti tank guided missile. It has been developed by DRDO to engage highly fortified enemy tanks in day and night conditions. The missile has fire and forget top attack capabilities with a passive homing guidance to defeat all modern main battle tanks equipped with composite and reactive armor. The missile has range between 500 meters to 4 kilometers. The missile weighs 43 kg and has a maximum speed of 230 meters per second armed with 8 kg of tandem shaped charge warhead. Nan missile comes with active imaging infrared seeker and millimeter wave active radar homing seeker. NAG is said to have a single shot probability score of 0.9 and 10 years maintenance free shelf life. The missile comes with various variant. The helicopter launched NAG is called Helena and is also known as Dhruvastra. Helena is developed for engaging heavily armored tanks in all weather conditions during day and night with a maximum range between 500 meters to 7 km. The anti tank guided missile uses IIR seeker that locks onto target before launch. The airframe is made up of composite material with high resistance to enemy countermeasures. The forward dome houses the guidance system. The middle portion of the body accommodates sensor packages and the warhead. A booster rocket is located towards the rear end. Helena consists of four foldable wings and four tail fins that stabilize it during the flight. A real-time image processor is also located next to the guidance package which helps enable automatic target detection and tracking capability. The digital autopilot helps in guidance, stability and control after launch. The Helena missile having a range of 7 km puts enemy tank commanders in curved terrain at severe disadvantages. Helena can penetrate armor as thick as 800 mm which is more than enough for penetrating the armor of light and medium weight tanks. Now talking about its trial, as a part of user validation trial, two recent tests of Helena were conducted from Rudra in April 2022. Initially, Indian Army will need 500 Helena missiles and nearly 40 launchers. Indian Air Force is also working on integrating Helena on light combat helicopter LCH. Now, as per the reports from the Financial Express, NAG and Helena missiles have completed all the trials. A variant of Helena weapon system called Dhruvastra is also being inducted into Indian Air Force. The flight trials were conducted from an advanced light helicopter ALH. The test involved firing and engaging of a simulated target tank. Now, in a meeting held by Defense Equation Council on 10th January 2023, under the chairmanship of Raksha Mantri Sri Rajnath Singh, the acceptance of necessity has also been granted for three capital equation proposals amounting to Rs 4,276 crore. The DAC has also accorded acceptance of necessity for procurement of Helena anti-tank guided missile, its launcher and associated support equipment which will be integrated with advanced light helicopter. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.